We're all looking for something. Like everyone I would dare to say in this room is looking for something. It's just on different levels and different degrees. Someone in here is looking for a man. Someone in here is looking for a woman. Someone in here is looking for their next breakthrough. Someone in here is looking for the next big opportunity for that contract, that tender that's going to be legally acquired. Right? You know, someone, someone in here is looking forward to their first child, marriage, different things. We're all looking for something. And you know what I've realized? Everyone is always looking. And I've come to the conclusion that we never really arrive. I, I, think, I think the ultimate destination will be heaven. That's when we'll arrive. But as long as we're here, we're still looking. There's, a, there's someone that I know, um, I was once uh, at this one house with, uh, with my mother, right? Was there, my mother was there as well. And when we left that house, uh, my mother could not stop talking about this man's house. Oh, so nice. But look, how many bedrooms is it? Do you know how much it is? I said, listen, let, let's not get into the numbers. We're all going to be depressed and it's just not going to be okay for anyone in here. The whole way home, right? Just talking about this man's house. And then some time later, I hear this man talking about needing more space, needing a bigger house, right? Now, here's the thing though. This is true of so many people in here. Do you remember when you said, oh, God, just be cantoniana, just got point A to point B, right? Po from point A to point B, you realize that there's point C as well. Now you, you, want, you, know, you want to go to point C, D. I don't know how to say alphabets without singing them. So I'm going to stop at D. Because I, I have to sing them to A, B, C, D. Um, but but that's, that's, that's the point. We're all on our way somewhere. And sometimes you look at people and you, you envy what they have because you think they've arrived. But no one in here has really arrived. They wouldn't be going to work every day and they wouldn't be trying at anything if they had arrived, right? We, we get to a certain place, it's nice for a moment and we realize that we, there's more, we need more. There's got to be more to life. But here's the thing though, I don't really have a problem with the fact that we never really arrive. I just have a problem with how hard it is. <laughs> you guys, it's, it's hard, man. It's, it's really, really hard. And I was thinking about this the other day, and I thought to myself, could it be? Because I used to think, I used to think that the way that life was set up is that it has occasional troubles, right? It was, it was, it, I thought life was set up in such a way that it is a good life with a couple of difficult seasons, right? The hard seasons. But now I'm starting to think that it's a hard life with a few good seasons in between, like, you, you understand what I'm saying? I'm starting to think it's, it's like just really, really hard. And then in there you have, you know, a few good seasons. You know, when he finally returns your call, then it's, oh, glory. <laughs> and then after that he goes to you and it's like, it's, we're, we're right back here. This has been life since how I've known it always. And I've really come to that understanding that life is hard. Life is really, really hard. And every day I have people who, uh, who criticize what I do by correcting me with this one powerful, powerful message. Uh, a lot of them often older than myself. Young man, it is easier said than done. Right? It is easier said than done. And sometimes I'm like, sir, how did you know that? How did you know that it was easier said than done? You've come, up, you've come across an incredible discovery. No, you didn't. Everyone knows it's easier said than done, right? Oh, unless if there was anybody in here who didn't know that it was easier said than done. Everything is easier said than done. So, ladies and gentlemen, I think we can come to the honest conclusion that life is, is just hard, right? It's, it's hard. But here's the thing, though. What I love about it is that we are on our way. And... The beautiful thing about never arriving is that even the tough seasons, you are passing through. Right, we understand this when it comes to the good seasons because when you get a car and then you realize that you need a, another car, then you need a faster car, then you need a faster car, then you need a bigger house, and you need that, then you need that. You re we, we know that. We know that we'd never really arrive, right? And thank God for that. Thank God for the fact that there's always more. Because that means 
when times are bad, that also means we haven't really arrived. Because how bad would it be for you to arrive and it's just bad? How, how, how terrible would it be for you to think you've arrived and where you've arrived, it's just bad. So we thank God for the fact that we are passing through.